according to the Quran, when you obey the Prophet, you obey Allah. If you don't obey the Prophet, you are an apostate and are out of Islam. If you don't repent, Muslims are allowed to kill you under Sharia law. And according to the Quran, in chapter 53, ayah 3 and 4, we can read, وَمَا يَنْطِقُ عَنِ الْهَوَى إِنَّ هُوَ إِلَّا وَحْيٍ يُوحَى Muhammad does not speak out of his own desire and everything that comes out of his mouth is nothing but divine revelation from Allah. Which means every Muslim must obey Muhammad at all times because it is divine revelation from Allah. Now Muslims claim that their Prophet Muhammad is the best example, the best of creation and the pattern of conduct. In other words, Muslims must follow Muhammad's words, actions and teachings. So now that we know that the Prophet of Islam is the best example and it's a must to obey Muhammad at all times according to the Quran. So let us see what Muhammad said in a Sahih Hadith about a man or a woman who cross dresses. Sunan Abi Dawood Hadith number 4098 Great Sahih. Narrated Abu Huraira, the Messenger of Allah cursed the man who dressed like a woman and the woman who dressed like a man. So if Muhammad cursed a man who dressed like a woman and a woman who dressed like a man, that means Allah Himself cursed a crossdresser. If Muhammad curses, automatically it means Allah Himself is doing the cursing along with Muhammad because don't forget everything that Muhammad says is nothing but divine revelation from Allah. So let us see if Muhammad followed the divine revelation and command of Allah himself. Sahih al-Bukhari hadith number 2581 Aisha. Muhammad said Divine revelation does not come to me in the garment of any woman except that of Aisha. So here Muhammad claims that divine revelation does not come to him in, except that when he's in the garment of a woman like Aisha. So here Muhammad did not follow his own sunnah and as you see he along with Allah cursed himself. Remember, everything Muhammad says is divine revelation, right, Muslims? In other words, we can conclude that Muhammad is a crossdresser wearing women's clothing, i.e. the garment of Aisha. Anything that comes out of the mouth of Muhammad is nothing but divine revelation. That means Allah cursed Muhammad because remember, the Messenger of Allah cursed the man who dressed like a woman and the woman who dressed like a man. So we can conclude that Allah Himself cursed Muhammad. Could that be the reason why Allah decided to cut off the aorta of Muhammad when he ate from that poisoned food in Khaybar? Hmm, Muslims, please, you need to leave this man-made cult because you cannot claim that Muhammad received divine revelation but at the same time Allah himself contradicting himself through Muhammad's action. Please download this video and share this all around social media. Thanks for watching and God bless.